Hi guys, I hope that you're well. I am back today with a slightly different video. It's not a cover, but I thought I would read all of my hate comments on YouTube. I haven't done one of these videos before and it came to me on a Friday night and I was just so excited, so excited. The tea is ready in my Stranger Things mug. Thank you to my Patreon, Brandon, who bought this for me as a birthday slash Christmas present. Love and life. The tea is very hot. It's possibly going to burn my mouth today as well as the remainder of my soul. Hashtag sassy Christina returns. I spent the weekend going through my comments. I'm not gonna lie. Let's start off with a positive note, okay? First of all, there's not really that many hate comments in compared to the overwhelmingly nice ones. So I really appreciate all of you guys. Second of all, it's actually really nice going through all of my comments and basically seeing people who were like commenting three, four years ago and you're still commenting today. Like, yeah, it was just really nice going through and basically seeing a bunch of names and thinking that person's a Patreon now or oh my God, that person commented like a week ago. Like it's just so cool because I know that a lot of people dropped out from when I started my channel. So if you're here, love ya. Love ya. Quickly before I jump into the video, what do you guys think about the fairy lights behind me? I used to have some before I redecorated, but they were like a white toned and they basically broke whilst moving stuff around, gave me a massive electric shock, so I had to throw them away. And I bought some new ones, but since I've just painted the wall, I kind of just liked the wall blank, but I do like the vibe. Does it suit? Shall I take them away? Let me know what you think. Anyway, let's get into the comments. Everyone loves her accent, not a big fan of it. Syllables are too strong, making it sound grungy. I mean, that's just how I speak. There are a lot of accent comments and it's just like, this is how I talk, pal, sorry. She's ruining it. She's deviating too far from Dallas, but the dude's vocals are so clean and tight, it's hard not to love and hate this. That one's about my Alexis on Fire cover and Ali is wicked but I actually didn't go as crazy as I could have in that cover. I pretty much stayed with Dallas's um, melodies minus the second verse and then I just kind of went ham. Hush? I've tried Googling Normandy Hush a million times and I don't know if they're basically telling me to shut up or they're telling me it's another song. I feel like if you're going to record a cover, it should be the audio of what we're watching, not a pre-recorded track with multiple effects. It's almost like this is a music video cover of a cover. You guys still crushed it and did a very killer job. So I have this theory that there are people that are basically called nice assholes. They're very happy to basically write criticism on your channel and they don't really care what they say or how they say it, but they always finish it off with a nice sentence at the end. If you're gonna be rude, just go the full hog. Like I'm a douchebag and own it. Too much production. I'll blame Ali for that one. Come on, at least turn the microphone properly towards your lips. Everyone knows it's fake, but at least do a good fake lip sync video. I have been rumbled. This one's my favorite one because it's on one of my tracks. I want to hear more of your voice that's not covered with echoes and higher music behind it. More original songs. Does this person understand what my YouTube is? My channel is basically ambient. That is my channel. <laughs> bracket, lyric cover, bracket. Song sounds nothing like the original, lol. I mean, I don't know if you know, but a lot of my songs don't really sound like the original song. You couldn't drop one bleh in there, not one. I mean, do you want me to sound like a dying cat? Bleh. This one is a favorite one because I remember this guy basically like going absolutely mental on one of my covers. I think it was Doomsday by Architects. And I think some of the covers are still there, but I did block him because he was just going for it, going absolutely crazy. So it starts off with, there are too many technical people out there who pick a fast song, highly technical, badass song and turn it into a slow, simple and honestly kind of gay song. We're still using gay as an insult in 2017. You're not cool or talented doing this, you're just gaying things up and showing people you need to simplify things to make it your own. Now, what does that say about you as a person slash artist, hmm? I feel like these people should just follow me on Twitter because I have never, ever, ever hidden that my guitar work is nothing but simple. I am like the simple queen. I am just sick and tired of seeing the same generic things posted on YouTube over and over again. Why not take a chance? Why not do something truly original? Why do what every other person has done before you? I, I can't really be bothered to read the rest of this. I'm not gonna lie, sorry. <laughs> it does end with though, if you choose to ignore my words and criticism for whatever reason you decide to give yourself, that's your prerogative. Yeah, I think I'm gonna ignore it. I just love it when people get so invested in their hate. I'm just like, wow, I really did something to piss this person off. It's great. Too much makeup. Enough makeup. 
Jesus Christ. I've got to get people to click on my video somehow. Just get into it next time, not trying to be rude at all. It's just when you talk for two minutes before the clubber, it starts to feel like a vlog. Good job though, you have a pretty voice. It's a nice asshole again. I tell you what, I just spilt tea on me. I tell you what, you go and tell the brand that I decided to work with that I wasn't going to talk for a minute before the video as if people can't even wait a minute or just skip it and then i'll just tell them yeah i didn't actually do anything for you i didn't promote anything but give me money oh my god tea is spilling everywhere is this is this broken or am i just very excited today Shit. it's still a good cover but it's my least favorite cover of this song i think it's the clean vocalist that kind of ruins it for me sorry not sorry oh please don't cover a dallas green with this auto-tune vocals i mean should someone tell her that Dallas probably used auto-tune? Please don't take criticism and abuse too seriously on YouTube. People will say what they want behind screens. Instead of deleting all negative comments and getting defensive and upset with every comment that doesn't like the cover or enjoy it, you should use criticism to improve yourself. So please don't start taking away dislikes and comments because you don't like the hate. Everyone deals with hate, you've just got to take it. I wanna quickly touch on this one because I remember which video this was on and it's still there. So number one, I don't delete all of my hate comments. I delete the ones that are stupid. There's literally a saying, saying that you can't argue with stupid for a reason. Comments that are constructive criticism are helpful. And normally if someone does comment something quite rude, I'm like, cool, any advice? And then you get no response. I do delete certain comments that are either abusive to my parents because it has nothing to do with my musical talent or I delete ones that are just ridiculous. There are loads of hate comments. If you look hard enough, you will find loads of rude comments on all of my videos. But I feel like this person just kind of wanted to like put their two cents in and possibly get to the top with a bunch of likes. Sorry, pal. It's so bad, we lost screaming, my friends. <laughs> While she sleeps isn't bring me of horizon, does not spoil their work. You sing very good, but if you want an acoustic, look their acoustic videos. Guitars are, ryth are rhythmic with arpeggios, so beautiful. Okay. This guy right here is my favorite because this person literally took the time to go on most of my videos and literally comment a very detailed hate comment. Every time I see this username, I love it so much. Why ruin such a good song making it soft? Things are just like they are, fuck. I dare say you slept with someone. If that was a guy, would you assume that he left his band because he slept with someone? Probably not. And the Scremmings. Bad, bad, bad girl. You can sing, you have a great voice, but guys, stop covering hardcore bands. Stop, stop, stop. You're not gonna enjoy my channel much, are you? <laughs> you went off beat a little after the beginning and then sang on top of all the wrong chords. Good try anyway. She sounds horrid singing this. And then I got a response to that comment from someone else saying, you suck. You just resend such a beautiful song. Good job for sucking so much. Damn, the guitar player is okay, but doesn't march the song. And the girl, she should stop singing altogether. Here I am, four years later, ruining everyone's life. Stop fucking frying. You're not Christina Aguilera. Frying? She's lip singing. I love it so much when people call lip syncing lip singing. It actually makes my day. The accent is new. I am British too and it sounds terrible. Overdone with the accent, ruined the cover. On the same video, didn't like the vocals, you're over exaggerating your British accent. Come on, none of us pronounce like that. So this is on Bring Me The Horizon Drown. What doesn't kill you makes you wish you were dead. I've got a hole in my soul growing deeper and deeper. Who will fix me now? Dive in when I'm down. Save me from myself, don't let me drown. I'm sorry that I'm from Surrey. <laughs> the singing is fine, but the lisp kind of ruins it. You can get rid of it through speech therapy. It'd do good for your vox. Sizzling sausages. What lisp? Their clean vocals wasn't really in the right key. After I explained that we're singing up an octave, okay, maybe it was because you used the original song or maybe it's just me. No, we're, we're just singing up an octave. It's really not a different key at all. This is so bad. You hub a great voice, but sorry, Bring Me The Horizon is not what you should be covering. And here I am just waiting for them to drop another album so I can basically cover all their new songs. I do not really like singers, but you really nice. Music normally involves singers. You sound good, but still not your music. This from is lyrics twisted from Paris and sounds. You are great, just want to hear your own song so bad. You're beautiful and you've got the lungs for those notes. Please make more. I don't even need to check what video that's from. I know it's from Holy. Let's just talk about this right now. When I was in uni, way before Paris were a thing, I used to write music with my guitarist Jake and 
we were both obsessed with ambience and reverb and that's how I kind of got to like finding my sound now. I reckon that a lot of people think that I listened to Paris one day and then just decided to do that. The reason that the song Holy is called Holy is because Paris released a song called Holy and my producer friend Arthur was like, Paris also have a song called Holy and it's still that kind of ambience. And because I was so certain that I've been doing this music for ages, I really didn't care what other people were gonna think of it. Like, if people are gonna think it's from Paris, people are gonna think it's from Paris. I've been writing stuff like this for so long. So the fact that Paris had another song called Holy and people were telling me to change the name because they might make the difference, because I had nothing to hide, I wasn't gonna change the name. So, little, little insight for you there. She can certainly sing, but her accent reflects really strongly and it makes it sound kind of off. Like the way she sings chant instead of chance. This is something the likes of Lily Allen plays off. Well, her, not so much. It's still a beautiful cover though. This is on Bring Me The Horizon. When, where does Bring Me The Horizon have chance in it? No stood a chance. Surely if Lily Allen sung that, she's also British, so she would just say chance. And isn't like chance how chance sounds? An American would be chance. I'm so confused, just so confused. Once again, you don't have enough voice. Not good at all. Sometimes I think that too. Oh look, it's our friend again. Made it even more gay, congrats. Your voice is beautiful and awesome, Nena, but is a little disrespectful change a lot of the song practically is other song with same lyrics. I mean, I wouldn't call it disrespectful, I just call it cover, but. This isn't a hate comment at all, but someone, someone that regularly comments on my videos has a username called Crispy Calzone. And it's just my favorite thing ever because all I can think of is that meme where someone posted like an ultrasound and, some, <laughs> and someone's like, that's a fresh lasagna. And they're like, that's my child. I like the way you covered songs back in the days. For me, the long reverb stills your voice too much warmth. Comments like that are always really confusing because when I first started doing covers, I literally just whacked on the reverb, like 30%, going for it, absolutely loved it. And now I actually like dial it back quite a lot. So I do kind of wonder sometimes whether people just say things to kind of like, maybe there's something about the cover that they don't like, which is totally fine. But I feel like sometimes people just say things even if they don't really understand what it means. Ah, oh, my studio app quit because I think I was trying to scroll. I think I was trying to scroll back too much. I'll take that as a hint and I'll leave it there anyway so I don't bore you guys and I'm a bit concerned about the weather as well. I actually do really like sitting you down videos. I think it just kind of like gives a bit of personality. I feel like my life's a bit boring sometimes so I can't really vlog all the time. If there are any videos that are similar to this, I don't know what else you could really do. You can't really just sit there and read nice comments about yourself all day. Do let me know what your thoughts are and if you enjoyed this and I will see you in the next one.